Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to the 2012 Children's Choice Book Awards nomination special. Here's your host for the 2012 gala, Jarrett J. Krasowska. Hey everybody, I'm Jarrett and I'm so excited to be returning as host for the 2012 Children's Choice Book Awards Gala. It's voting season and it's a very exciting time for all of the nominees. Last year, in the fourth year of the awards, we had 500,000 votes. That's more votes than all previous voting seasons combined. And this year, let's do it again. Let's get more votes than any previous awards seasons. That would push us to a million votes. So this is the year we're going to get a million votes. So get excited, get reading, and get ready to vote. And the 2012 nominees are... In the category of Kindergarten to Second Grade Book of the Year, we have Bailey by Harry Bliss, Dot by Patricia Intriago, Pirates Don't Take Baths by John Siegel, Three Hens and a Peacock by Lester L. Lamanac, illustrated by Henry Cole, Zombie in Love by Kelly DiPuccio, illustrated by Scott Campbell. In the category of third grade to fourth grade book of the year, we have Bad Kitty Meets the Baby by Nick Brill, A Funeral in the Bathroom and Other School Bathroom Poems by Callie Dacos, illustrated by Mark Beach, The Monstrous Book of Monsters by Libby, Libby Hamilton, illustrated by Johnny Duddle and Alexi Bitskoff, Sidekicks by Dan Santat, Squish Number One, Super Amoeba, by Jennifer L. Holm and Matthew Holm. In the category of 5th grade to 6th grade book of the year, we have Bad Island by Doug Tenaple. How to Survive Anything by Rachel Bouchals, illustrated by Chris Philpot. Lost and Found by Sean Tan. OK For Now by Gary D. Schmidt. Racing in the Rain, My Life as a Dog by Gareth Stein. In the category of Teen Book of the Year, we have Clockwork Prince, The Infernal Devices Book 2 by Cassandra Clare, Daughter of Smoke and Bone by Lena Taylor, Divergent by Veronica Roth, Passion, A Fallen Novel by Lauren Kate, Perfect by Ellen Hopkins. In the category of Author of the Year, we have Jeff Kinney for Diary of a Wimpy Kid, Cabin Fever, Christopher Paulini for The Inheritance, James Patterson for Middle School, The Worst Years of My Life, Rick Riordan for The Son of Neptune, Rachel Renee Russell for The Dork Diaries 3, Tales from a Not-So-Talented Pop Star. In the category of Illustrator of the Year, we have Felicia Bond for If You Give a Dog a Donut, Eric Carle for The Artist Who Painted a Blue Horse, for Anna Dudney, for Llama Llama Home with Mama, Victoria Kahn, for Silverlicious, and finally, Brian Selznick, for Wonderstruck. So get excited, get voting, tell your friends, tell your librarians, tell your teachers, tell your booksellers, tell everybody you know to vote, because this is the year we're gonna break a million votes. Voting is open now, and the winners will be announced at a gala in New York City on May 7th. I'll see you there.